something? Hello. Where's this go? Hmm. Free side, free side. Well, this looks a little better. Oh, the kings. Oh my god. Oh my god, the king. What? Oh, why didn't I think of that? Looks like we got a hooker over there. King's gang member. Okay, they all look like fucking Elvis. Okay. Make a brief stop at the Atomic Wrangler, where the booze is cheaper, the table's more friendly, and the women. Hey, baby, <laughs> head on down to the Atomic nice Wrangler knife. if you want to have that. a good time. Ah, oh, how interesting. Hello. You want to get your hands on some of the deadliest weapons around? Yes. Head just down the street to the Silver Rush. You won't be disappointed. Oh, this is awesome! So we've got our first casino. A good gun shop, apparently. The King's Place. Open enrollments. Come Liquor. to the Silver Rush for all your energy weapon needs. Energy weapons? Oh, that's so tempting. I wonder if he knows I have one equipped. So that's why he's, like, taunting me with that. Saw a guy try to rush through the south gate a few days ago. Nothing left but dust, you know. Hmm. Just another generic. Hey. Wow. Um, wow. Let's go shopping. Actually, let's go to the you casino. Want I want to dead. Deal. Really dead. Stop by the Silver Rush and we'll give you the meat. That's it. Atomic Wrangler. Alright, let's do this. I got a decent luck. Guard. Slots. Got an entertainer who is apparently a, uh, a ghoul. Whoa, baby. Am I looking at a mirror? Or are you just that ugly? <laughs> Whoa, excuse me? What? You mean you're not part of the act? Huh. Sorry. Thought you were the heckler Garrett hired to spice up the shows. <laughs> uh, who are you exactly? Either you need to get your eyes checked, or that famous fleeting thing is true. And since I happen to be world famous, you must be going blind. Okay. Name's Hadrian. Bet you never saw a ghoul in a suit before, huh? Of course, you don't exactly strike me as the worldly type. You perform stand-up comedy? Eesh, is my act that bad? Or are you just that dumb? Yeah, that's right. Got me a nice juicy contract with the management. Hmm. Yeah, they can't be paying you that much. Okay, I admit it. I ain't exactly rowing in caps here, but what do you want? I'm under contract. I can't get out. Okay. Yeah, go on. Scram. I always had a soft spot in my heart for these ghouls in these games. Looks like blackjack tables, more slots. Yep. Nice outfit. Welcome to the Atomic Wrangler. What can I get you? Mm, what goods and services do you have to offer? We've got liquor, chems, and whores aplenty. Pick your fix, and we'll oblige. Our only rule is no sampling the merchandise. Caps paid in advance. If you'd like to do a bit of gambling, we have an exchange at the back of the casino on the left. Uh, a little r, &R. Since you're new, I'll lay out the rules for you. The prostitutes here aren't slaves. They decide who they service. You best make a good first impression if you want what they have to offer. Rooms hmm. are just a few caps a night. Your choice of company is extra, assuming anyone's taken a liking to you. Okay. Any work? I have Excuse some work me. I need handled. <clears throat> Back before we instituted the caps up front rule, we used to allow customers tabs. Mm -hmm. Well, needless to say, a few customers snuck out without paying their bills. We need someone to collect. The job would pay a percentage. That sounds like a lot of fun. <laughs> Will I have to shoot anyone? Because I really want to shoot someone. Um, what kind of caps are we talking about? If you bring all their debts back, we'll give you a cut of each. 25% is more than fair. It would add up to 150 caps if you bring them That's all in. That's not very much, actually. <laughs> yeah, it kind of work costs time and money. 50-50. All right. 50-50 it is. But you better bring back all of the caps. If we hear you crossed us, the next bounty hunter will be coming for you. All right. 
got yourself a deal. Great. There are three people who need to be tracked down. A real mixed basket of fruits. Their names are Grex, Santiago, and Lady Jane. Grex? Grex is a bit cracked, but mostly harmless. Just don't mention anything about his lazy eye. Okay. He owes 138 caps and should still be around Freeside. Lady Jane? Lady Jane fancies herself a high roller, but she's just another dirtbag NCR prospector. I'm not sure where to find her. I hear she's run goods for the followers of the Apocalypse in the past, but other locals might know more. She owes us 250 caps. Santiago is a suave son of a bitch, but a total pansy when it comes to fisticuffs. He owes 212 caps and should be around Freeside as well. Okay. And what do you got on tap? Not a whole lot of money, and I don't actually want to drink. Goodbye. And you, hey. James Gear. Welcome to the Atomic Wrangler. What can I get you? Use some help with my reputation in Freeside. Oh, cool. For the right caps, I might be able to put in a good word or let people know you're not such a bad guy. What do you have in mind? Uh, I want people to like me. All right, I can chat you up, but it's gonna cost you. I'm not risking my reputation around here for nothing. Wow. Wow. Well, let's just, you know what, never mind for now. We're going to think about it, see if there's any need for it at some point. So we can gamble. Well, we're not at these apparently, but some of the others. Slots. I'm not partial to slots. Guard. Very hard to pick. Well, that's the, the case. We could rob this casino. Hello, cashier. Welcome to the Atomic Wrangler. Looking to exchange? What do we have to exchange? What's the deal? Oh, NCR money for chips. How many chips? Is there any? Legion money for chips. Huh. But how much do I have? Here's your chips. So I have a hundred chips. Alright. Blackjack. Roulette. Slots. Hello there. Now, do I need chips for all of these? Is that the way it is? No, it is too. Interesting. Um, I like blackjack. Now, I don't know how much the luck changes these things. Let's, uh... Actually, what's the max bet? It was 100. Oh, no, hold on. Increase bet. Okay, increments of 10, oh, 5. And 1. Alright, well, let's go with that. 10. Should we count cards? Um... I believe on a 16 what we want to do is stick. Yeah, that's okay. Increase bet. Or no, keep the same bet. On a 12 with a 12 showing. A 12, I'm pretty sure we want to hit. Could bust. 10. Or 20. Definitely stay. 6, 8. Hooray! Deal. I don't know if you showing. In fact, I would like to uh, double down. Damn it. Well, that was unlucky. So there's a basic strategy with Blackjack, and I don't actually remember it uh, perfectly. But the reason I doubled down there, I had a 10. Double down means you play one more card. And you always want to do it if you have an 11 showing. Um, and if you have a 10 showing, you do it if the dealer has a bad hand. Uh, which he did. So, if I remember correctly, and I could certainly, certainly be wrong here. Ooh. So, I don't think it's worth doubling down here. I'm definitely going to hit, and then I'm going to have to stay on the 17. Yeah, see, good thing I didn't double down. So, does the luck factor into this at all, I wonder? Maybe it makes it less likely to bust. That would be interesting. Um, hit. In which case, I should actually just be much, much more aggressive with my betting. I feel lucky when it 10 chips. Now, I wonder if that meant I was in break even as if 21 21. So sick. Oh, come on. What is this crap? At least it's not asking me for insurance. Blackjack! Looks like I got bonus chips for that too. 
hit. 15, stay. Hit. 17, gotta stay. Jesus! This is going terribly. Double down. 21. There we are. Almost breaking even again. Oh, this is going to be boring for you guys if I sit here and gamble all day. Um, let's do one more hand. 21. Double down. Bam. Okay. Then we're going to try the roulette. Just to mix it up. Have a seat and give Lady Luck a chance. Um, so, yeah, one to one on the colors. How are the... Oh, because I can put on the, in the middle. That's kind of cool. I didn't realize that. I've never actually played roulette for reals. A bit more. Let's go 35, black. Oh, place bet. And finish. Black, 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 black. And black! I wins! Hooray! I feel lucky. It must be a luck check. Um, you know, we could just bet on a specific number. Like, say, 18 for Quill 18. We'll probably lose several times. Actually, this is way too much money to put onto that. Well, we can place a bet here. And here. Okay. Can we let it ride? That would be kind of awesome if we could do that. Let's see how lucky we feel. Nope, black. Oh, big loser. Wait, it reset my bet amount actually I didn't even put very much on there alright let's uh... do the same thing maybe I should just play slots actually what I should do is pause for a while and play these things red 21 red well so we break even there hmm slots max bet that's bet at all spin Great. Oh no. We're out of money. I'm gonna buy some more. What is my luck? <laughs> oh, I'm not actually addicted to the game. Eight. See, I should win a lot. Welcome to the Atomic Wrangler. Cash for How many? So it's a one to one. Alright, let's get the. Let's get 500. Here's your. Let's just play the slots. At 100 at a time. And spin. It's not even lined up. Boom. Ah, come on. One of these has got to win. Damn it. Decrease that. Alright, last spin, then we get to something else. <laughs> Losing 600 caps here. <gasps> oh! I'm gonna keep playing, I got chips. I'm gonna go until I go broke, and then we'll leave. Or maybe we'll get lucky. Jeez, I should have kept playing blackjack. At least there I have more, uh. I got XP? For. Wow. All right. Boo! We'll come. We'll come again another day. Maybe this place is crooked. Yeah. Guns, 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 guns. Yeah. Well, he's got a laser gun, so. Welcome to the Silver Rush. Van Graaff. I'm afraid I'm going to have to search you before letting you in. The only weapons allowed on the premises are the ones we're selling. Really? Really? 
All right. It should only take a moment. There. I've stored all of your weapons. You clear to enter. When you leave, I'll hand them all back to you. All right. A meeting. You'll have to wait until it's over. Mr. Okay. Soren, please get to the point. The second half of your payment is late, and I want to know why. Miss Van Graff, my associates and I have decided that we wish to renegotiate the terms of our deal. Might I ask for what reason? The shipment was delivered. The guns were tested before leaving this facility. Regardless, we feel that the quality of the weapons is below expectation and hope to adjust the price accordingly. Ah. I think I understand what the issue here is. Excuse me for a moment, would you? Do it. Never break faith with the Van Graffs, Mr. Soren. I expect you'll have the rest of our payment ready tomorrow Wouldn't morning. They shoot? Okay, everyone. Show's over. Back to work. Wow, this place is. Wow. There's no way to ever steal anything here. No wonder they took my guns. Now, it's interesting that uh, she still has her power fist. But. Wow. Oh, I so want in. I can open this door. Hmm. No, nothing. Eh? This is it clean water? It is too. Good. Take a little sip, make sure we're not thirsty. Ah. Hmm. No back door. Darn it. Oh. Jean Baptiste Cutting. Gloria Van Graff. Oh, I can loot the ash pile. Quick save. Bottle caps. Hello. Sounds good. Get the fuck away from me. The okay. last man who bothered me volunteered to help test our weapons. Welcome to the Silver Rush, where only top-of-the-line energy weapons can be found. What can I do for you? Hmm. Uh... Do you have any work? It just so happens a position opened up recently. We currently need another body to guard the entrance outside. Think you can handle that? That doesn't sound very interesting, but I actually want to ingratiate myself to this woman, so yeah. Wonderful. I already have a man outside who can show you the ropes and get you set up. His name is Simon. He's been with the family for years, so listen to what he says and follow his instructions. You know, if Hi. I get friend- Welcome back. Did you have news? Questions. Not at all. Yeah, it would be interesting if I could get friendly with her to the point where I can bring guns inside here and kill everyone and steal their stuff. What do you think of the Gunrunners? There are chief competitors in this region and many others. That makes them our enemies. Mm -hmm. While I respect their business acumen, I'm obligated to try to destroy them however I can. That's business, after all. Sure, sure, I get it. Very little. Same as everyone else. We attempted to deal with him when we first moved into the area, but had no luck. He must have his own weapons supplies to keep as many laser-armed robots operational as he does. Hmm. Makes me wonder where they are. What about the Legion? I've only heard rumors, since this is the furthest east our operations go, but the rumors are pretty scary. They're said to be a huge slaver nation, with all the soldiers obeying their lord with unquestioning obedience. Sounds like a man I'd like to meet. Hmm. Is this a family business? Yes, it is. My brother and I run this particular branch, but our family has operations all over, particularly in California. Interesting. Uh, seems like a bad neighborhood to open a store. Look around, and you'll notice two things. First, we don't lack for security. I'm not worried about anyone breaking in here or stealing our goods. Not that we don't occasionally have attempts, but even those prove useful. Do you know how much target dummies cost? Back to my point. The second thing you'll notice is that we do not sell cheap merchandise. Everything here is second to none. People who buy Van Graaff goods typically don't care where they have to go to get them. Okay. Tell me about Freeside. This place is certainly lively, that's for sure. Did you want to know something specific about it? Tell me about the kings. Ah, the rulers of Freeside. The kings are a bunch of boys who refuse to grow up, and this is their playground. Their leader seems different, though. The few times I've dealt with him, I've been impressed, despite myself. Really? 
Unfortunately, he rarely acts. The Kings believe that everyone in Freeside can do whatever they want, provided they can back it up with force. Which suits us just fine. When we first arrived in Freeside, the Kings protested when we kicked out the original occupant of this establishment. When we reduced several of their members to glowing puddles of goo, their objections vanished. Since then, we've left each other alone. Hmm. Tell me about the followers, not that I know who they are. I don't really are have much to do with them. Maybe? They seem to have an aversion to weapons technology, and those who possess a great deal of it. Their loss, really. What, uh, what is there to do here? Well, you probably noticed the Atomic Wrangler across the street. Yeah. That's pretty much the place <laughs> to go around here. They make it a little loud around here at night, but the business their proximity brings more than makes up for it. Other than them, you're better off skipping Freeside entirely and just heading to the Strip. Tell me about yourself. Oh, there's not much to tell. I was born into a big family and don't get along with my parents, so here I am, as far away from them as possible. Uh, NCR? You must not know a lot about my family, or you wouldn't have asked that. The Van Graffs and the NCR have been enemies for decades. Okay. They've tried to block our expansion for years, but we've managed to grow regardless. The problem is, they have too. The NCR is huge now. We're talking on a scale that's difficult to imagine. Time was, we could fight them and hold our own. Not so anymore. My family has enough men and guns to field a small army, but the NCR can field a really, really big army. Fighting them is out of the question now. Alright. Well, actually. Hell, that's a lot of energy weapons. Guess we dropped the ball on that one. <laughs> Welcome back. Yeah, Did I you want have I want to shop. Of course. You don't have that many caps. You've got some terrible quality weapons, actually. The recharger rifle is interesting. The questionable DPS. MF breeder. Microfusion breeder, so it recharges itself? That's kind of cool. I'll take the drain cells. Fat man little boy kit. Um, decreases the weight by 50%. Oh, laser RCW recycler replenishes ammunition. Quarter of the shots come back. Yeah, that sounds really, really good. And laser rifle focus optics. Plus three damage. Okay, yeah. Uh, and we're going to carry that as well. So we're losing a lot of money here, but that's okay. Bunch of ammo. We're actually okay on ammo, I think. Except. And, oh, we can't mod our weapon yet. we got to do that outside. You. Hello. Give me my guns. Welcome to the Sylve. Ah, oh, crap. Don't tell oh, me I you're my new them. guard. Yes. How'd you know? You can always tell a rookie. <laughs> you look too eager. Get the job a few hours, and the shine will come right off. You'll be covering the other side of the door there. Take your position while I get your stuff out. Alright, well you already gave me my stuff. So, I can mod this with a... rifle scope. Like, I'm wondering... The, the only thing I'm worried about is... Should I... be saving this stuff until I get a unique gun? Because you can't pull the mods off again. I don't think. Yeah. I don't know. Whatever. Let's just do it. If we can't pull the mods off, then I'm going to yell at the game for being retarded and fucking me, because I hate that kind of thing where, like, oh, you're screwed, uh, you made a poor decision, and now you have to suffer for it the rest of the game for no reason. So, presumably, maybe if you repair one with the other, it'll be okay. So, the plus three damage is going to be... Alright. Cover this side of the door. Good. Look around and get a feel for where customers and risks can enter and exit the area. I get your gear ready. Okay. Oh, I'm actually locked in place here. Hello. Okay, now let's get you geared up. Van First, Graf your armor. Combat armor. Standard issue is your run-of-the-mill combat armor, with a nice dark coat of paint for both brand recognition and sheer intimidation. Hello. Back. Next, your weapon. Guards are required to use rifles. Anything lighter compromises your combat effectiveness. 
All right. Anything heavier and people are too scared to come in the door. What's your preference? Laser or plasma? What is the difference, although I already know? Lasers have a high rate of fire, but not a lot of stopping power. Plasma, on the other hand, is slow as a mule, but with a kick to match. So, what'll it be? You know, actually, I want to take the plasma, just because I'm... I want to play with plasma. Nothing wrong with going plasma. Just make sure you hit what you're aiming at. Now that you're equipped, a quick word on the job at hand. In a nutshell, we're here to keep the riffraff away. Drunks, punks, and capitalist vermin are to be turned away. Potential customers are to be permitted normal entrance. That is, after we pat them down for weapons. An unarmed man is a lot less likely to try to steal something with several armed guards around. Yeah, I noticed. Don't start any fights. I don't care if some jet junkie just insulted your mother. We're here to promote violence elsewhere, not start it here. All right. Lastly, don't abandon your post. We're getting paid to stand next to this door, not talk to someone down the street or head to the glamorous. casino. That goes double for any thoughts of splitting with that gear. Every now and then, some young punk thinks he can run off with Van Graaff property. Aww. Trust me, the rifle and armor are nice, but they're not worth your life. Other than that, relax. There's usually some eye candy coming and going from the Wrangler over there at some point, so the view's not too bad. Okay, so apparently I've auto-equipped it. Questionable DPS, but it's fully repaired. Excellent body armor. Okay, I can still squat. Well, I can move now. Settle in. You've got some hours left before your shift ends. Should I just hit wait? Let me save here. I'm gonna wait like like this for a little bit just to see if something happens. I fire here off comes a shot. The oh, I'll let you handle this one. Cool. Actually, I can wiggle. All right. Hey, you. Bam. Hi there. Is this where I can pick up a laser gun? Sure is. Go on in. Mm. Sorry, sir. I can't let you in. Company policy. Sounds like a stupid policy to me. You sound like a stupid policy. Good. Stick to the rules. This is interesting. It, on the basis that it's different. Another one coming. You're on. What's is coming? Oh, hello. You look quite refined and like a good potential customer. Doom, 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 doom. Bam! Oh, that'd be so funny. Hello. Uh, hi. I was, uh, in the area and thought I'd stop by to look at your weapons. Can I go in? Hmm. Oh, yeah, we're gonna have to search you first. Fine by me. He doesn't sound He's right. clean. See? Not so hard, is it? Oh, wow. Heads up. Looks like we got another customer. I know these things are slow, but this these seem like so much fun. Huh. Right in the nutsack. Ba -da 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 -da. 